on to more cowboy news. Oh yeah, now now I'd love to hear you. I'd love to hear you on this one with your man. And I didn't even want to start out so racy, but fuck, I ain't doing nothing else. <laughs> All right, pull the people in. What happened? I ain't a cowboy fan. Word, that's a, a picture from I don't know nineteen fifty something, sixty mm. something presented itself mm. where they try to make it more modern. <laughs> 50, 60s. <laughs> Corey added ten years. Um, has presented itself that shows Jerry Jones um, present when you know they were integrating schools in the sixties. Mm. Um, some black kids were walking into a school, I think, in Arkansas. In mm. Arkansas, and um, a mob of white people were there, like not greeting them in the most favorable way. No, uh, that's and it, that's a kind way to put it. The, the picture shows Jerry Jones um, present. Mm-hmm. So the internet went crazy. I got seven thousand tweets and texts and. DMs, mm-hmm. yo, this your man. This, this is who you choose to stand by. This shit squad and all of that. And so here we are. Your take. Uh, I, my take is I'd love to hear from you guys on this, oh, man. On this matter. This, <laughs> I bet thought Jerry my, Jones was racist when he, yeah, what he did, said about the uh, the kneel and shit. He, he said some crazy shit, right? Y'all don't think Jerry Jones was racist? Not at all. Like I didn't think that was. I, don't think so. I didn't think that was news. <laughs> I don't think like, he's right. I don't know him. I don't that's, think how I, that's how I pictured those childhood pictures to look. <laughs> let me ask you. Hey, let me ask you. Can a person change? <laughs> Just yes or no? Yes. All right, because we've also heard multiple. <laughs> all right, never mind. You want... Go ahead. Now I'm going to let you get your shit out of here. Get, I, get your I'm, shit I'm, 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 yes, a person can change. So a person can change. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Do you think... We, we've heard from black people directly, mm-hmm. told directly to us, mm-hmm. said how valuable and important Jerry Jones is to their life and what they've set up for them, their children, their lineage, the whole shit, like getting a business and shit right. They learned manhood they've from learned, him. Yes. They learned business from him. He pulled them under their wing and helped them and their family. Mm-hmm. And this comes from countless people. Yeah, this ain't one or two. This has been a thing for years. So am I... Do I have to hold you? Do I have to say you're the same person you were when you were a, a, a what teenager? This is a school, so elementary school too. Ele- yeah, so you were a kid there, the person you were then, and Jerry Jones. How old now? 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80, 80 something, 80 something, seventy, eighty something. Yeah. Okay, am I supposed to think you're the exact same person you were as a child? Are you? This, are, are any of us the same person we were as a child? And yeah. we only in our thirties and forties. I am. Okay, well that's you. <laughs> salute, <laughs> salute for the lack of growth. Made some type of- no, salute for the lack <laughs> no, of growth. I ain't agreeing. Uh, you have to. I'm, I'm, yeah, yeah. I'm a thousand percent agreement wise. Salute for the lack of growth. That's your thing. But um, that's your thing. Yo, hey, hey, you that's be, get, that couch is spicy. I'm saying you said you are the same person you were when you were a child. Agree. That's I agree. get your shit that's off. Your lack of growth, my nigga. That's on you. You got to live with that. But I think people grow and change, and I just don't like when the internet go looking for shit from your childhood to try to make that be who you are today. That's all. Bigger than that, it's a couple other things. One, um, if you're talking about the 50s and 60s in fucking Arkansas, that's that's what was going on. Like, that's what so was going dope. on. So if you're talking about the 50s and 60s in Arkansas, one, Jerry Jones in the back of the picture. You know what I'm saying? Like, he ain't there with the rah, rah, with a baseball bat, not excusing him. We don't even know his involvement in that particular thing. That's one. That's true. That is true. That's true. And then number two, um, Sky, man. <laughs> then number two, um, if you grew up in fucking Mississippi, if you grew up in Arkansas, if you grew up in certain states during mm-hmm. the 50s and 60s, that was instilled in you by your parents, your community, and your environment. Mm-hmm. So you ain't, as a child, you're not making your own decisions. You're being fed what to think. And as you get older, you go through college, you go through life, you go through your own experiences, you determine right and wrong for yourself. Your parents and your church and your environment determine right and wrong for you as a child. But as you get older, you stand on your own too and you make your own pivots and tangents to believe what you to believe to be true. So you can't hold somebody that's 80 years old today by the same standard that he might have felt at 12, 10, 9, 15, whatever the case may be. You, you can't hold somebody to that. That's my opinion. No, you swayed me. I understand what you're saying now. 
Yo, could you give a take or no? <laughs> <laughs> could you give a take or no? We didn't hear from Parks. Oh, okay. Right. Parks said he's racist. I don't know if he's racist. You just said, I, yo, you've been. I said, I'm not surprised if he's racist. Oh. Parks during the, and I, during Par- the kneeling shit, he didn't, he didn't say the kindest things. He said, Parks none of my I players are going to kneel for don't the flag know. or something like that. Like, that shit is sus. And that wasn't long ago. That was a few years ago. That's our side. Can I talk now? Even hold on. Let me just respond to the get yeah, shit off, please. I don't think that was more racism. I think that was more business, like, business control. This shit is like that. this is you you. I I can't have any distractions to the business. Again, I'm not. Oh, great! Dis- y'all are going to my point. <laughs> okay. So neither one of y'all can point me to this list of actions to indicate how Jerry Jones might feel about black people when it's not a business. Uh, business decision or when there's nothing for him to gain from them. That's not true. I'm asking. That no, is, I can't. I, I, please. We had Pac-Man Jones on the show. Mm-hmm. Right? Well, not on these couches, but on other couches. Mm-hmm. And Pac-Man Jones said he didn't know anything about life. Well, not life, but business life and being a man. Jerry Jones taught him how to be a man and how to get his priorities in order, his business in order to take care of his family. Jerry Jones's family is taken care of for generations. Pac-Man, he don't have nothing to gain by helping Pac-Man Jones get his family life in order at all. Just keep playing football. He, he could have okay. just been Okay, a, so we disagreed. In. We could. Pac-Man Jones. Pac-Man is, Jones is a football player. True. Mm-hmm. There's no world that you're telling me Jerry Jones doesn't have something to gain from a football player. No, what I'm There's saying. There's no world where you're telling me that. What I'm saying is he, he, don't, have anything, he don't have anything to gain the from the physical from attributes of this football yeah. player. Pac-Man Jones' family being set up properly don't benefit Jerry, Jerry Jones. It could have some underlying potential benefits where if you happier at home, you might perform better on the field. Mm-hmm. My, but that's not even a guarantee. My question was only, do we have a list of action items that we could point to that show us how Jerry Jones feels about black people when there's zero to gain? And your, I don't think that your Pac-Man Jones point refutes that or speaks to that. I do. It's fine though. Is are, is there anything else on the list? No, I was, I'm to? just going by something or do we definitive all, or that do you, a man or do we stated. Only I can't have football player. Examples. Yeah, yeah, I can't. I can't speak of anything definitively yeah, right now. That. But I could go by okay. this man's word that mm-hmm. said basically, yo, I was lost until I got to Dallas, and Jerry Jones showed me all of these things and how to be a man. He said that here. Jerry Jones didn't have to do that. That's what your agent is for. That's what your your business people is for. You know what I'm saying? You got your own accountants. You got your own financial advisors. You got your own agents and managers or what have you. Mm-hmm. I don't have to put you under my wing and help you get your life right. I would want my owner to do that. I would as, I, I would as well. I said the owner does not have to do that. He does not. And I would want my owner to do that. So I want to applaud that. <clears throat> it still don't tell me how Jerry Jones may feel about black people when there's nothing to gain. True. New Joe Biden. <laughs>